Hello and this is just a very quick tip and it's about hair dryers. Now these are very inexpensive things. You can pick these up for about two or three pounds these days. Um, making sure that um, you don't obstruct the back of the... That's what's where the air goes in that way. So make sure that's never blocked. And if, you, if you've got the chance of taking that off and cleaning the filter out, do that. Because these can get really hot. And I always keep um, the nozzle on mine because it directs the heat. Now when you are actually... Um, dry in canvases and canvas boards and things like that there's a few things you've got to be careful of do not go too close if you can help it because you don't want that to get too hot too quick so i always stay about let's say six to seven inches away and i go in a pattern of left to right and then up and down and then left to right and then i'll show you exactly how to check it to see if it is dry So after you've dried your canvas, especially canvas boards, um, always use the back of your, your finger like that. Never use your, your fingerprint then, because that's going to leave grease spots. And you don't want grease spots on your, on your painting, because the, 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 the acrylic paint won't stick to it. No, it doesn't like grease. So I'll use the back of your finger like that, because there's no grease ducts in, um, in the back of your finger. Now, when it's dry, you'll see it dries to a matte finish. Just because it is surface dry, it doesn't mean that it is dry. It is not cured. So be very careful when you add in more layers to this. Even when you've used the air dryer, you don't put too much thinning agent into your acrylic. Or you don't rub too hard because you will lift that paint. Paint will lift off. It takes two weeks to cure. Yes, it does. Two weeks to cure. So just be very careful when force drying it with a hair dryer. And um, always allow your canvas and your canvas panel to, to cool down for a couple of seconds, even the, even 30 seconds. Um, otherwise, you're going to put another layer of paint on there. And because it's warm, it's going to dry the layer very quickly. So, very quick tip. Invest in a hairdryer. And just take your time. Follow those steps and you will be fine in the studio. So, thank you very much for joining me in the studio. My name is Clive from clivesart.co.uk. Please like, comment and subscribe. Please leave comments in the comment box below. And I'll see you next time. Nice. Hello and welcome. Yes, this is just a quick little advert for my medium mix formula. What is medium mix? Well, it's a blend of different types of acrylic polymers and one thing or another and retarders. And I'm not going to go into the recipe as such, but what this actually does is I mix this with a little bit of water, which I'll show you in just one minute. And I use that to thin down my acrylics to use in my wet and wet blending techniques and my acrylic techniques uh, in place of water. Why? Because if you over thin acrylics by more than 30 to 45 percent with water, the polymer strains will actually break down and your paint could flake off. I'm not saying it will, but there's a good chance it might. So what do we do with this? Well, this is available on the website. All you need to do is put about four or five squirts of that formula into a little container. And you've seen me doing this during the videos. And I add a roughly about 20 to 30 percent water to that and that's all the thinning liquid that i use to use during my painting processes and that actually keeps the polymer bonds in place because these little polymers polymers like to hold hands yes if so if you over thin them with water they tend to lose grip and break away and flake off now so if you want to pop along to www.clive5art.co.uk and go to the shop, then that product is available with many others that are there with videos. Hey, welcome. Thanks for stopping by. It's time to learn with our friend Clive. So grab your brush, have a great time. And don't forget to click subscribe. Visit Clive5R.co.uk